Okay, hello everyone, and welcome back to Shrink's Awakening. I'm Professor Icepick, and tonight I'll be going back to Alundra for the PS1. So, let's get on with it then. All right, just going to do a quick audio check. Okay, let's see. How do I sound? How do I sound? How do I sound? How do I sound? Hey, you know what? That seems okay. All right. <clears throat> I got the game splits itself into chapters, but the chapters are just sort of random. All right, so yeah, let's go straight to this uh this dungeon then. Oh, so all the doors are open now. Maka, that didn't seem to work. How about we run away like girls? I know that that's the way forward, but I also know that that... Yep, herbs obtained. You will not succeed, infidel! Behold, even now your life seconds are numbered! Maka, you are much more resourceful than I had thought. Try this on for size. Thank you. 
Damn it. Come on, I jumped! Eh. Fine. Oh, come on! Ugh. God damn it. <laughs> now, why do I suck at this? A second, that doesn't make any sense. Okay, I think I see what I was doing wrong there. Okay, and okay, maybe not. did wrong there. Yeah, and I shouldn't have done that either. Ah, damn it. Okay. Okay, yeah, no, I need that to uh, make it across. Hmm. Oh, come on, I jumped! Oh, God. Okay, I didn't even think about that. Thank you. 
Ah, I hit jump! Alright. <laughs> what am I doing wrong here? I really should have just called this game Brutal Zelda, honestly. Oh my god, I made it. Okay. Okay. Ah, damn it. Okay. So I know what I need to do now. Okay, fair enough. Okay. This is going to be a pain in the ass, but I think I can manage it. Go, jump. Get that up there. Oh, come on! I did it one time! Ugh. Okay. Whew. Finally! We cannot let you live even one moment longer, Assassin. Take this! You cannot run. Your only duty is to die. Hey, what? Wait, that wasn't fair. Why did they get to attack me before I could move again? Oh my god, a third wave of these fuckers? How many of these are there going to be? Okay, four. Do I hear five? Oh my god, there are- HOW MANY ARE THERE?! <laughs> Make it stop! I hate it here. OH MY GOD, STOP! Please stop? Oh my god! Is this just going to be infinite? Is this going to be the rest of the game now? Or is there like a trick that I need? Okay, fuck this. 
I think I know what the trick is, and I'm angry that I didn't figure it out sooner. When he's back, perhaps this will chill his blood. I, oh. Wait, really? That... <laughs> Boo! Boo earns! It's locked. Ugh. Oh god. Okay. Um, hmm. Okay, I, okay, I can actually leap on there. Fair enough. Okay, I need that barrel. Oh, and I can do that apparently. Ah, okay, I see. Yeah, these statues move, by the way. But apparently they can only move in one specific direction. Okay, fair enough. Can't push them up or down, just left and right. Okay, let's try that again. And you can only move them one step. Okay, fair enough. Okay, so you can only push them one time and they can only move left and right. And I need to cover all of those switches. So, one. Two. Three. Okay, so no. All right, let's try that again. Okay, and apparently if you push them in a direction where they can't move, that also counts as moving them. So, yep, okay. Up and down doesn't count, though, so... Okay, fair enough. I knew I figured it. I knew I would figure that out eventually. Okay, that's helpful. Hmm. I feel like I'm going to live to regret this, but at the same time, I'm curious. So. Figured as much. 
So where does this take me? Oh, this was actually the right move. Okay, I can live with that. <clears throat> He's traveled this far in the cave? Activate the trap at once! Oh, great. Well, at least I made it to another save point. This one lets me heal and stuff. Okay, that was a mistake. Oh my god, there's some donkey uh, Kong ass bullshit right here. Look at this. This is like fucking arcade donkey Kong. Ow. 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 Okay, so I need something else. Okay, uh... Then how the hell am I supposed to get up there? Uh, let's reset the room and <laughs> heal up. Alright, let's see. So, Actually, that reminds me. I wonder. Okay, no! Damn it! Well, that was a mistake. Let's try that again. Okay, so yes. That does not do anything. Oh, that stays... Okay, good to know. For the future. Okay, so I can't jump that way, I guess. Let's try climbing up this ladder.
Okay, I guess that's just nothing then. The engine room is located below the hall of pillars nearby. The switches here must be activated correctly to proceed. Start from the side least favored by the Almighty, pressing each lever once, then twice in alternating order. Ow. What the fuck? Okay. Side favored least by the Almighty. what they're saying is like up, down, up, down, up, down, but I might be wrong. Oh, wait. No, I get it now. Okay. So up, then down. Then up. down then down no that's not it Okay, I see. So I did, in fact, miss something then. All right.
A switch must be activated to allow passage. Start from the side least favored by the Almighty, then pressing each lever once, then twice in alternate. Mm. Hmm. Okay, let's try that again. There we go. Okay, let me read that puzzle one more time, then. The switch must be activated to allow passage. Start from the side least favored by the Almighty, pressing each lever once, then twice in alternating order. So the side less favored by the Almighty, that would be the left-hand side, I would imagine. But which left is left, I guess? Okay, let's see. Left, right, left, left, right, right. So, let's reset the room and try again. So, left, right, left, left, right, right. There we go. Engine room is located. The switches there must be activated correctly to proceed. Start from the... Okay, so...
Let's see, what do we have over here? Ooh. I do not like that. Maka, stay back, you godless infidel! Ah! It's locked. All right. So now we go the other way, then I guess. Damn it! Left hand inoperable, right hand functional. Okay, so I take it this is going to be the left hand then. So I need to go to the right hand, which is the opposite one. All right, that's it. No more Mr. Nice Dwarf. This cannon volley should be the end for of you. Ow. Oh, come on. Ah. Come on, why? Why are you doing this? Come on. Ugh. Yeah, no, I understand that. I'm just trying to figure out how I should go about doing that. I mean, that's what I'm figuring, but like... Damn it to hell. All right. Throw. Ah, nope. Okay, okay, that was dangerous. Okay, good, one. Oh my god. Two. Are you, are you kidding me? Okay, it doesn't look like that's really doing much damage. Ah, alright. Okay, final- God damn you to hell. <laughs> it's like, calm down. Alright. Come on! All right. Ah, come on! No, I understand that, like I said, they should have called this Brutal Zelda. Come on! Alright. Okay, so... Do 
not want to waste that wonder essence. I'm so the fuck? Yeah, those some would be wrong. Yeah, all right. Let's try the arrows then. Oh god. Okay. Uh Oh my god, that actually worked. <sighs> I did not enjoy I did not appreciate that one bit. All right, let's go back elsewhere. I'm going back to the save room to heal, replenish some magic. God damn it! Stop doing that to me. All right. I guess I just assume that the arrows wouldn't have worked because usually they don't line up right anyway, so, you know, it's just one of those things where you just sort of assume that they're not going to work and... Ugh. Hey, you aren't too bright to get caught in such a simple trap as this. Oh well, live stupid, die stupid, I always say. Begin with the most delicate finger. be the pinky, right? Okay, and then I guess we just move on from there. A distant thump is heard, as if something large were shifted outside. Large boulders also seem to have fallen into the next room from somewhere above. Like how that was basically just like a 
cutscene. Buck obtained. All right, cool. <clears throat> well, finally got my first book of magic. Do they still cost one seed, or do I have to pay out two now? Oh, I have to go over here now. Ooh, okay. Thirty dollars. Another thirty dollars. All right, let's uh go back around. Oh, good. Okay, so it only it still only costs one seed. Then good. I'm glad. Oh God, this again. Until I come to think of it, I didn't check what was down the other way. I might have missed out on some cool stuff now that I think about it. Okay, I know where that is. Now right, let's check out the other way then. Right, now I recognize this. This is where I initially started. Okay, so... Okay, I can make it. It's just... There we go. Made it. Oh, we got a Gilded Falcon. Oh, that was what? Why did I think that was like a Deep Abyss or something? Alright. Okay, well I got another Falcon, so that's something. Okay, so I have to go the upper way then. Hmm. 
Okay, well, let's go back. Oh, wait a second. Oh, no! Oh, no! <laughs> oh, boy. That was a mistake. I should have kicked down the ladder, obviously. Oh, well. Let's do that yet again, then, because I'm an idiot. I feel like there's something up here, and I'm not sure what. Or maybe it's just teaching you that you can walk on top of them, I don't know. Uh, here we go again! <laughs> Alright. Yep, toss. Hop. Hop. Toss. No, I hit jump though. Ugh. All right. Oh, why did I do that? Sorry about that brain cramp. God damn it! Seriously, the perspective in this game really messes with you. Okay, that was a screw up. And that was another screw up. Okay, I want to see if I can kick down that ledge. No, are you kidding me? Alright, that's not cool, man. Okay, so I have to reset that. There we go, okay. So now I can actually backtrack either way. leg of the dungeon. Invader has been spotted! Has been sighted! Activate the trap now! Oh god.
Darnaka! You follow at the risk of your life, infidel! You shall perish! Okay, and then... Huh. Oh, I should have just gone down there. Oh. You're dead this time! Without a doubt, my superior midget mind! And a key. Yeah, this is gonna lead straight to the boss, isn't it? I praise her lofty efforts in making it this far, infidel! However, I must put an end to your folly here! Ooh, okay, well, let's, let's backpedal for a second there. Alright. Alright, let's see. So... 
Do you want sometimes hear the words yet not understand? I said it's over! Oh wait, I see. Uh huh. Okay, not sure what that was supposed to do. I guess I'm supposed to be quick about it. Ah, I see. Ah, damn it. Okay, I see. I got. I got to be really quick about this. Okay, fair enough. All right, let's try that again then. Okay, run, 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 run. Jump, jump. Okay, and. All right, so now that door should be open. So, yeah. Okay, maybe not. doing wrong here, I wonder. <coughs> okay, so... So...
Ah, I see. Hillary under advance, now and forever. Formation 42, ready to brain picks. Take him down now. Physical strength has been completely restored. Ooh, okay. Not bad. I'll take it! I'll take that too. Okay, so... Alright, fair enough then. You have desecrated the sanctity of my ancient home. You must be an agent of Melzos. It seems that you are not my enemy, however, but neither have you proven yourself my ally. I have created this fold in time, space with my magic. We shall soon see whether you are friend or enemy. Or enemy or friend. Warrior or coward. Oh boy. Okay, how do I fight this guy? I like how it keeps scrolling even after you pause. Okay, so just literally run away. Got it. Ah, seriously, what the hell? Okay.
Okay, I guess he ran out of bridge. Cool. Such resourceful survival skills can only be... Wait, that crest! You are the releaser! I am Nerud, releaser. You must know that I am one of the seven guardians. I stand alone as the sole survivor of the giant tribe. The prayers of Miming and his people have sustained me these many years of solitude. However, even the power of prayer has its limitations. Please accept my apology for doubting you, releaser. I sense the courage and sincerity within your soul. Hmm, I see. Nava sent you, did he? That is excellent. It proves he has chosen to fight Melzos at last. I have waited for that confirmation for many, many years. I know you shall emerge victorious. Hmm? Let me handle this, Alundra. Step back. Zorgia, you betrayed Wilda. You betrayed the Gazek. And now you have taken the foul side of Melzos. You are a mercenary bastard deserving only death. <laughs> tsk, tsk, Nerud. You have quite the sharp tongue today. Why must you use words so sharp as to cause pain and hurt? Because you once cared for me, I planned to spare you. But now your little speech has changed all that. Lord Melzos has ordered your death, and I'm now inclined to give him what he demands. Such an ugly scene, and it's only going to get uglier if I have any say in the matter. Which, unfortunately for you, I do. Your turn, Alundra. It's time to bleed. Not that I hold a grudge, of course. I'm just following the orders of my lord and master, Melzas. A very prudent course of action given his power, wouldn't you say? If you must hate someone, hate Melzas, not me. I'm just a pawn bound in gleeful servitude. <laughs> Who alerted the Munchkin Brigade? They come! Aren't you lucky, Alundra? It seems that your little friends have arrived to save the day. The time has come for me to depart, dream child, but rest assured that I shall find you and finish this. Until then, dreamer, lead a happy life without regret. You never know when it will all end. Murderer, you have slain Lord Nerud. Let me tear out his quivering gullet with my bare hands. Now, hold them down so we can beat him to death. Kill him, slay him, pick him, smash him. No, my children. This is not the one who did this to me. The one you would condemn is the only one who that can save you. Lord Nerud. It's true, King Miming. His power will save this land and return peace to the hearts and minds of all. I understand, my lord. Young one, step forth. Alundra, you possess a strong name that shall serve you well. Please take another thing that will serve you in like manner. Here is my crest. Melza sent his minions to retrieve it, but they failed. Use it to destroy him! My material form is at an end, my children. Leave here lest you perish as well. Goodbye, my lord. Have faith in yourself, Alundra. Despite the hardships, you shall prevail. Yeah, hardships, nothing. Oh, no. Receive the Topaz Crest. Lord Nerud would want us to help you, Alundra. Please accept this gift to help your quest. Receive the Aqua Cape. What the hell does that do? What, does it let me dive underwater? We will join you in your struggle against Melzas, but we must keep our defenses up here. Besides, from what I witnessed of your skills, you don't require help from such weak ones as us. Good luck, Alundra! This is really embarrassing, Alundra. I'm sorry I tried to slay you. Um, here, take this as a kind of apology. Receive 50 guild. 50. 50 dollars! Well, that's how much the game probably would have cost back in the day. Oh, we 
we can ne we cannot go back. We we can never go back, unfortunately. Okay, so This is the closest one to the village. But I want to go somewhere else first. Let's see. What does the aqua... Sand cave lets you go in the sand. Allows movement in whirlpools. Possession activates this. So yes, it does let me go in the whirlpool. Mm -hmm. Lake. Okay, yep, this is where I was going to go. I just want to search for one little thing. Seems that Topaz is etched into the stone. Topaz stone has been placed in the stand. I really thought there was a warp point around here. Could have sworn there was. I guess I was wrong, though. It's kind of a bummer, but so be it. Woods, beware of falling simians. Oh, hey! Cool, okay. Optional dungeon. Hmm. 
Now let's just do the optional dungeon then. Why not? Oh boy. Where's that going to send me? Oh, under underwater. I don't like this. This is going to be something. Alright, let's see where this one sends me. Okay. And we have hit 30 officially. Yay! 30 hit points. A low rumble of falling rocks can be heard. See what this room does. Okay. Oh no. Oh boy. <laughs> Underwater platforming. Yummy yumma bumma. Alright. Okay, so let's see. So I just gotta walk over there. Oh boy. This is just disorienting to look at. Okay, 
how do I get out of here then? Seems like this should be the right direction. Especially since I see that warp point up there. So then, where exactly do I go? Use the bubble to go back up. Oh, really? Okay. I thought I had to use the warp point. My bad. How do you use the bubble to go back up? Or, oh, wait. Or do you mean the... Okay, no, it's not the cape, obvi obviously. Yeah, but no, how do you use the bubble to go back up? That's what I'm wondering here, because I cannot apparently touch this thing. All, okay, so ride the bubbles. You can only ride the big bubbles. All right. There are holes. Oh, okay, I see. So. Okay, so those clearly aren't the big ones I need. I think it's under one of the jugs. Okay, fair enough then. And not that one. Or that one. Or that one. There it is. There we go. Okay. Okay, so I gotta ride the bubbles across them or something or jump on them. Okay, that wasn't a good idea. So 
Are they going to respawn in the exact same... Oh, okay. I don't even need to respawn. All right, cool. All right. So... Do I need to use the bubbles to jump across, or is this just one of those... Uh, I can't see. Oh, okay, I guess I don't. Uh, okay, that's clearly not the right way to go. I uh, can't see. I uh, can't go that way. Uh, or that way, apparently. That's kind of bullshit, honestly. Okay, let's... <clears throat> uh, I don't think I'm gonna make it. Yes, I did. Yeah. Uh, hmm. yeah. Okay, that didn't really work, I guess. Okay, uh... Okay, I'm not sure exactly. Let's see, so do bombs work underwater then, or <laughs> how am I supposed to move them rocks? Or was moving the rocks in the first place the wrong idea? Okay, whoa, okay. Okay, that didn't work. Come on. Okay, are there like more <laughs> areas with falling rocks that I gotta deal with here then? I mean, that's what I'm thinking at this point. Alright, let's warp back and see. Let's see. Did they all... Oh, they did. Okay, let's try doing it without knocking off any of the bombs then.
Ah, okay, I see. Looks like there's another switch around here somewhere, but I'm not sure where. Ah, I see. Okay. So that's where the other teleporter is. All right, fair enough. Okay, and that's the way forward then, I guess.
sure what that was all about. I see, so I can't make it back up there.
I am at once amazed and proud that you have progressed this far, Releaser. I am Stenia, Queen of the Waters. Your actions have been shown to my heart by the rivers and oceans. Over the course of human history, there have been many gods. Not long ago, there was a race of giant gods called the Gazek. You have met one of them, Nerud. The Gazek were carved from stone by the hands of ancient humans. The seven Gazek were revered and feared by the ancients. Soon their prayers gave life to the Gazeks. They literally became what humans believed them to be, but the Gazek did not want to share the power of human prayer. They fought each other for it. They killed each other for the prize of human adulation. All but one of them perished. Only Nerud declined to fight his fellow gods. He watched with a heavy heart as his brothers slaughtered one another. But when the killing subsided, Nerud found that he was a god no more. The ancient humans had long since lost faith in the warring Gazek and a god cannot exist without the faith of others. Soon another god was born from the prayers of the people. That one was Melzas. But he was not the god of eternal peace for which the humans had prayed. He was even more flawed than the Gazeks had become, using fear to gain the faith of humans. But Melzas feared the wisdom of humans. He knew that they could strip him of power. Therefore he began slaying whomever seemed to threaten his existence. Somehow you have managed to escape his machinations to this point. Melzas hmm? has been watching us, Alundra. He has used my own water against me. Take this, Alundra! Melzas will soon destroy this place. Leave here, Alundra. You must hurry. The destruction comes. Fiend Blade obtained. Ooh. I likes the sound of that. Wonder what the fiend blade does. Okay, so it looks like I've got to use my shadows more when it comes to platforming. Good to know.
And bam, it's gone. Well, at least I got a stronger sword. I think. That sword is stronger, right? All right, now I gotta go back to the village. Okay, well that's good. At least it's worth it. I remember one guy was telling me not to get the legendary blade because it made everything just sort of... It, it basically made combat pointless from that point on. There we go. Would the village be in such disarray if you had not come? I wonder, Alundra. I wonder. I saw it too. It was a ferry, all right. Where's the pond? West of the village. Oh, okay. Well, fair enough then. Oh, yeah, here. Ronan is saying weird things again, Alundra. Bizarre, even. I wanted to move to the capital city, but they rejected my application. I think they know what's happening here, and I fear I would bring the curse. And they fear I would bring the curse of the nightmares with me. What is it, boy? Are you here to speak with Maya? <laughs> She's not here. Ronan is an intense man, but I don't think he's evil. Oh, Lundra, I've been looking all over this village for you. Listen, there's something I need to ask you. My life has been in danger several times recently. Once I was about to be smashed by a boulder of tremendous size. Ronan appeared at the last minute to rescue me. You and Septimus must have discussed this. Do you think Ronan had something to do with my being placed in danger in the first place? Yes. Yes, you're right. It's more than some coincidence. But why did Ronan save my life after putting me in harm's way? Oh, there we go. 
I'm sorry, Alundra, but I heard what you were saying, and I have to ask. I don't understand why Ronan saved Luda's life, but I have the feeling you do. So Sibyl's dream told you that if Ludus died, his spirit would return as the Holy Sword. Which means Ronan saved Ludus to prevent you from obtaining the sword. But how could he know about Sybil's dream? I don't think Sybil would tell Ronan something like that. Wait, Alundra, have you prayed to Melzas? When I first came to the village, Ronan warned, wanted me to pray. Of course I refused. What? You prayed? I thought you might have. To pray is to allow the gods into your mind, Alundra. Melza saw your thoughts and learned about Sybil's dream. Let's go to the sanctuary and destroy the statue so Ronan has nothing to worship. That's the only way we can be certain to drain Melzus of strength. Are you with me, Alundra? Let's go! Well, let's at least save the game first, then. Look at how little life I have. Ronin's Conspiracy. You know what I am saying? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'll just buy three of these for now. you finally made it let's go inside um gentlemen first oh is she gonna betray me well well alundra i see you are with maya today the statue of melzas is hidden in the basement of the sanctuary i can feel it even standing here oh the gods have shown themselves to you have they Yes, Ronan. It was wonderful. They asked me to pray to their visage. Do you think me so dull as to believe you? I, if you have seen anything at all, it is a devil, not a god. You want me to take you to the statue I keep, not to worship it, but to destroy it. If you underestimate me, you are likely to be severely disappointed, children. Understood, Ronan. Now get out of my way, and please don't try to prevent the inevitable. Huh, arrogant girl! Beaumont has always known of the statue in my sanctuary. Everyone knows. And they not only approve of it, dear child, they pray to it as well. How would they react, I wonder, if you were to destroy the object of their fevered supplication? I'd wager their reaction to be much less favorable than you would hope, little ones. Be that as it may, this is not over, Ronan. Not even close. I'll prove to everyone that the statue is the source of the evil, and it will be destroyed. Those words of blasphemy shall return to consume you, heretic! <laughs> what was that laugh? <laughs> it's like, do. <laughs> Ronan is the murderer. I'm sure of it, Alondra. What's more, I believe the next target is someone else near you. We must strive to protect the rest of your friends before he strikes again. 
I'll stay with Septimus. You must watch Jess. We'd better hurry. Darkness will soon shroud the village. I'll meet you at your house tomorrow morning. There are two graves left in the cemetery. I don't want to put you in one of them. Be careful, Alundra. Well, let's grab the rest of those uh, <laughs> herbs, you know, and uh, stock up, I guess. Oh, seriously? I've already got nine? Oh, wow. Okay. That was quick. Alundra, you should get some rest. You look tired. You know what I am saying? Always running around from one place to another. You deserve to relax for one night, my friend. What? Me? I cannot sleep yet. I have much work to do. At odds with Rodan. <laughs> he just walks into bed and he's like, eh. <laughs> like, eh. Well, that was weird. Alundra dreams about what Ronan said as he left the sanctuary, but his exhausted body eventually overcomes his anxious mind. Alundra gently sinks into a deeper slumber, and then all too soon, the moon and stars surrender the heavens to the morning sun as a cock crows in the distance. Yeah. <laughs> Wake up, Alundra! Wake up! You, it's just he. Just. Breathe's not the foul air of this evil world any longer. The people of the village have gone to the graveyard. Come with me, Alundra. No, not just. No. He was our best friend. He was the best character in the game up to this point. I no longer know what you are saying! <laughs> How will I know what you are saying now?
Like how they're just like staring each other down there. Ronin and Alundra. Just found you on the verge of death and nursed you back to health. And how do you repay his kindness, Alundra? You kill him! Yes, Alundra, I lay the blame for justice passing solely on you, murderer! You're the one who probably killed him, you asshole. Alundra, I... Here, take this key, Alundra. I found a clench in Jess's hand. I have no doubt that his last wish would have been for you to have this. Receive the small... <laughs> Receive the small key. Little baby key. If you need anything, Alundra, anything at all, I will gladly help you. All you have to do is ask. Use the small key. Receive Jess's diary. Alundra, if you are reading this, I must have expired. Boy, this is not good, you know what I am saying? I want to see what Ronan was doing at all the graveyard while you were sleeping. I know you were suspicious of him, and so was I. But I did not want you to take him on alone. I am very scared, Alundra. My hand quivers as I write. I must resist the urge to crumple this note and throw it away. It would be so easy to forget about Ronan, walk upstairs, and retire. But I cannot do that, my boy. I, I consider you as my son, and I do not want you to be ashamed of me. So I have summoned up all the courage I have remaining to write this letter. Before I go to Ronin, Alundra, after my wife and son died, I was a broken man. Your iron will and like demeanor have fixed me. I did not know you for long, but I am glad that I did. Thank you, Alundra, my dear son. Love, Jess. Inside the box is some kind of battered broken armor. Receive the broken armor. Whoa. You are awake! This is progress! This is good! I was afraid you might be having an eternal rest, you know what I am saying? My name is Jess. I'm a swordsmith here in Inoa. Decent money, make my own hours, no big whoop. What is your name? Alundra, hmm? Pleased to make your acquaintance, Alundra. You were on board the clock, were you not, Alundra? You are lucky to be alive, you know what I am saying? They have not found a piece of that ship bigger than my fist! Ah, uh, so we're just having a fight fight. But let us not talk about that. Let us talk about you, my new friend. You are welcome to stay here until you are fully recovered. <coughs> I live by myself. Once you leave, I'll be a lonely old fat man again. Not that you should feel bad. Boy, I almost forgot. That book next to the bed is a special diary. You want to use it? Fine by me. I got it for myself, but how many ways can you write me a sword today? Well, we're just going to remember him, huh? Alundra, not too long ago, the people of this land prayed to idols. They were material representations of our gods, you know? But then, quite unexpectedly, the king decreed that all idol worship was forbidden. The people had no choice but to comply. We watched the destruction of our statues in tears. 
About that time, the palace in no the North Lake was submerged. Sunk, actually. That was five years ago, but it feels as if, as if it were just yesterday. You know what I am saying? Since that time, we've lost the passion to create. What if the gods became angry and took our passion from us? I'm not saying they did, but it certainly makes me think at night, my boy. But, gods and no, I must regain my passion, you know what I am saying? <coughs> I can almost hear Olin's spirits talking to me, demanding that I make the finest weapons once more. Or even better, demanding I assist in the fight for this land. This is the mining box. It's actually just a bomb, but since it's used for mining, that's what they call it. <laughs> a nice way to get through rocks, you know what I am saying, Alundra? With this, you could easily get into the coal mine, but it's just too dangerous to attempt, my boy. <laughs> Here's the plan. I go to the mine, I see if it's safe, and maybe I let you go inside. <laughs> you stay here, alright? One way or the other, I'm going to keep you alive through this. Oh dear, Lundra, you are quite late. I was worried, but no matter. I'm just happy you're safe and sound. The most horrific day in Alundra's life was finally at an end. As he closed his eyes, he could still see Jess's gentle smile. As this image faded, Alundra silently whipped bitter, bitter tears of shame and regret. However, even the potent tears failed to wash the pain from his heart. As he implored the gods to stop the madness, he tumbled into Russell's slumber at last. <laughs> I'd rather not go through all that again, if I can help it. Damn it, I was early. <laughs> hmm, nothing but cobwebs. Broken armor. Stored in Jess's special chest. Jess's letter. Touching goodbye note. Oh, hey, 1688. That's the day and the year I was born. Alundra, I need you. It's my daughter, Elaine. Uh, Elaine has collapsed. Please, Alundra, I beg you. Use your powers to save my daughter. I swear to you, I'll change my ways. If she dies before, I've been away too long already just to fetch you. I must return to her mom. Please come, Alundra. Please, I'm begging you. Well, that must have been the drunk guy. All right, so... Ah, so another nightmare, huh? Yeah, that's Klein's place. Even Maya cannot enter Elaine's nightmare. It seems as though the dreams themselves grow stronger. What? Maya? Why, she should be in the house already. Now Elaine has fallen into a nightmare. How foolish I was to believe that the gods were merciful and kind. They're simply heartless and cruel, nothing more. May has gone into El Elaine's dream, but can't destroy the nightmare alone. Elaine has multiple personalities. I've counted four of them. Her nightmare will be incredibly complicated to conquer successfully. May has gone into alright, so... I'll quit drinking! I'll pour out every bottle of booze in this house! Just help my daughter! Please save Elaine! May have told me that Elaine is trapped in a nightmare. That poor girl has already suffered so much in her short life. She doesn't deserve this. Mm. I can't possibly defeat this nightmare, Alundra. I don't even think you can do it destroy it by yourself. Will you let me help you, Alundra? Will you let me join you in her dream? Yes. Thank you. I know we can do this together, Alundra. In fact, together, I believe we can conquer almost anything. 
You must, must remember to be extremely cautious, for my sake. Alundra, Maya, please save my daughter. Are you ready to attempt entering Elaine's nightmare? Or Elaine's? Like, I don't know how to pronounce that. I've seen both, honestly, or I've heard both. Elaine's dream. <coughs> wait, what? Alundra, please wait for me. I can help you. Okay, so we're just going to, like, switch back and forth, it looks like. That's cool. I do that. Wait, I okay, thank you. Just what I needed. Alright, let's go over here then and warp around. I'm loath to admit it, but I'm stumped. Please come and help me figure this out. Damn it. <laughs> That's not where I was trying to go. Damn it. Alright, let's just warp back there then. Oh, come on! No! Damn it! Well, now I'm pissed. Alright. <coughs> Alright. Let's see what's stumping her. All right, Alundra. Any ideas how we're going to open this door? <laughs> I still can't believe I let you use me for a stairmaster. I must admit, you were great. Wait, I don't. I don't, don't want to go that way yet. I want to go this way. Carrying too much to keep the herbs. Oh wait, she can jump higher than me? Well that sucks. Okay, I should have known that was going to happen. <laughs> 
have been trying to figure this one out while you were catching up. Seems like each switch that appears creates a corresponding floor tile when one steps on it. Wait, I have an idea. I'll step on the switches and you leap across the floor tiles. Got it? Alright, uh, sure, I guess. Oh, crap. Lacking all due respect, that blue hero boy. I already explained to you how the switches trigger the steps. Watch what I do before you go off leaping into space. Oh god, it's a yoke. They brought Yoku block puzzles in fucking Alundra? Well, let's try that again, but this time, how about a little concentration? Hmm? I'll step on the switches and you leap across the floor tiles. Got it? Fucking Yoku block puzzles. Okay, there we go. All right, Alundra, the path to the door is open. This is the moment of truth. Let's get to it. I don't like where this is going at all. Okay. Uh -huh. Yeah. Hop, 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 hop. Jump, jump, jump. Okay. Okay. Oh no, that's not where I wanted to go at all. Oh wait, yes it is. That's actually exactly where I wanted to go. Come to think of it. It's locked. No, oh, okay, no it isn't. No, it is not where I was trying to go. Okay, fair enough then. Carrying too much to carry the herb. Fine, fuck it. Give me the herb then. Thank you. Okay, so. I see. Okay, maybe I don't Too much to keep the herbs, all right. This is impossible! How are we going to get across? This chasm is too far f and far too wide to jump. Use her as a platform! Oh, wait. Okay. Yes, okay. I told you I'd give you a head start!
And the key! Hooray! <coughs> Next area, I guess. Oh, God. Ah! Now the true test begins. Our task is to destroy all four of the nightmares that have seized control of your subconscious. If even one remains, I'm afraid Elaine is doomed to perish horribly. Which nightmare do you choose to start with? The colored crystal you destroy in the center appears to determine the order to attack the dream. Oh wait, that's a save point. Let's you let's use the save point. Elaine's 15 minutes. What the hell does that mean? <laughs> what the fuck does that mean? Alright, is this gonna be like a boss rush or what exactly? Ah, crap. Come on, let me up. Well, no, I get that, it's just, it doesn't make any sense. Okay, so... There's a time limit, but still. Oh, come on! There is a time! Are you kidding me? No, come on, that's not fair. Ugh. Come on, let me. I literally died from that. Okay, fine. Oh my god, this is going to be so fucking annoying. Alright. Jump. Jump. No! No! Come on, let's... Ugh. Seriously? Okay, great. Ah, come on! Ugh. Okay, and if I don't do it, I have to go through this. Then. Great. Oh, in the no! Come on! Dear God in heaven, what the fuck? Try this again. Hop, hop, hop. Damn it to hell. Okay.
damn it! Alright, what's next? Fucking Donkey Kong ass section here. Okay, I see. So I should have just used it to warp. Okay. So that's just how I reset the room, then. Got it. Alright. Jump, jump, jump. Oh, thank God. Okay, cool. All right, where are you sending me? Okay, I see where I made my mistake. I'm just not sure if I'm going to be able to get back there. Nope. Looks like, no. Looks like I'm stuck. Looks like I screwed myself. Okay, maybe not. Okay, multiple rooms? That's bullshit. I'm sorry. This is stupid. Alright, let's try that again. What the fuck am I supposed to do? Alright. Damn it! Seriously, how the fuck am I supposed to do that? Okay, I... Wh how? How on earth, earth am I supposed to do that? See, I can't even... Okay, I, I don't understand. Think you need to bring that girl? How do I bring her? How, do, how am I supposed to bring her in here? <laughs> All right, let's try this other one. Maybe there's something I can do here. Okay, so. Thank you. 
Okay, so I can't do this one yet either. So I just killed those guys for nothing. Okay, let's let's go back then. Let, let's go back to the first warp point I climbed out of then and see what that's about. Let's just save here, I guess, because you know, might as well. I mean, I did something, I guess. Okay, I, I think I see what I need to do now. This is very... This is insane, is what it is. Okay, so we go here. Go southeast. Kill those guys. We got a key. All right, so we we have a key now, I guess. Not sure what that's going to do, but I bet it does something. Oh, Christ. You're late, Alundra. What's the matter? Gonna let a girl best you? Here's a chance to redeem yourself again. Help me release a trap in this room. We have to push the right and left switches simultaneously. Let's get to it. Watch me closely and press your buttons when I press mine. Damn it! Hello, Alundra. Are you awake or have you succumbed to some kind of weird spastic dream too? Pay attention and push your switch at the same time I push mine. Ugh. Okay, so I uh, apparently I had to <laughs> get a flag going. You're late, Alundra. What's the matter? Gonna let a girl best for you. Blah, 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 blah. Yeah, okay, no new dialogue. Watch me closely and press your buttons when I press mine. All right, Alundra, the path to the door is open. This is the moment of truth. Let's get to it.
Oh god, a boss fight? Oh, hello. It's been so very long since I've had visitors. By all means, come in and die! Oh, you guys. Okay, I'm not sure what I'm supposed to do here. Maybe use throw oh boy, okay. That actually damage them? Tell if that actually damaged me. Oh, yeah, no, that's damage apparently. I need to hit the orb inside them. I think that maybe fire might be better on this. Oh boy, I'm trapped. Mm, actually, it seems like ice was doing better. Though, maybe. Okay, yeah, no. Arrows are useless. Uh, nope, that also bounces right off. Okay, so I need to use wands, I guess. Damn, so it's like I'm clearly damaging them now, but like, sword is best. Are you sure? Because I was not like getting jack shit done with the sword earlier, but. Yeah, no, sword is not best at all. Oh boy, okay, and. Ow, okay, yeah, no, that's bad.
Okay, I see. So. This is a, an annoying... Yeah, I'm not hurting them, am I? I killed one, so I beg to dig different there. There we go, now I got the other one. Good. Ugh, hated that. Hated it a lot, honestly. The hidden eye has been overcome. It's basically just going to be a boss rush of nothing but <coughs> original bosses, huh? God. Yeah, this isn't going to get old fast. In 15 minutes, more like 15 hours. Alright. Let's go. Oh boy. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Oh. Yeah, I'll take it. <clears throat> okay. Yeah, no, I'm I'm cool with this. Thirty one, baby. Ah, damn it. Damn it, that's not cool. Okay, so... Alright, so... Damn it! Ah. Oh. Damn it. <coughs> Ooh, I don't like this one bit. Huh. 
Oh god. This is going to be bad. Oh wow, okay, and uh... No, come on, that's not what I was trying to do. <laughs> All right. It's like, ah, oh, damn it. Okay, so I still need the fair enough.
Okay, not sure. Ah, here we go. Maybe this will take me somewhere I need to go. I can barely get the switch to budge. There must be a way to gain more leverage. Hmm. Alundra, I swear, I really didn't take you for the type that treated women like doormats. Hoping for. little things. I'm sorry you came here. Ah, you I remember. Wait. Oh, God. You again. Okay, that's not good. I see, okay. Oh god, okay. Yeah, no, it's... Hmm. Okay, there we go. <coughs> well, that was a lot easier with just one of them, that's for sure, although the icy floor was kind of a pain. The hidden eye has been crushed. Okay, so... Go 
with that one, I guess. I have no idea how to get back to the start of this one. <laughs> There you are, Alundra. This rock seems to be placed rather inconveniently. Any bright ideas how to overcome this? Well, well, you're full of surprises, aren't you, Alundra? I just wanted to go back to the the original area so I could save. Let's see. When lands rage bells forth only the fruit of ages. Damn it, I should have known. Okay, 
Okay, so that's how you do that. Alright. the yes thank you it's exactly what I needed all right It's like I missed something there. Ah, shoot. Gonna have to, like, figure out how to trigger her to show up again.
So apparently I'm supposed to jump on her head to get the key in there, but... I see. Okay, fair enough. So I guess I don't need her then. That's fine. Okay, that was not the right one. Man, I'm completely lost now. At the very least, at a loss of where to go next. Yeah, that's how I got to the uh, room with the... Um, maybe if I kill these turtles... Maybe if I kill all of these turtles, something will happen. Nope, nothing happened after I killed all the turtles. Okay, so... What's over here? Okay, already been there. So, when land's rage bellows forth, only the fruit of ages shall silence the fury. Okay, I have no idea what that's supposed to mean.
Okay, I see. So I need to do something with these rocks then. Liftable sign teleporter in the row of them. Okay, so I need to plug up some of these rocks then. Or what am I saying? Plug up some of these rocks. Okay, so I need to do northeast of this room. Then the one northeast of the sign, okay. Damn it, okay. The other two are directly west of R5, so and then directly southwest of, okay, so southwest of R5. So that's right. Then the one that's oh, really? Oh yeah, I see what you mean. The they're big. God damn it. Okay, they're bigger. That's the thing. It's not that they're more orange. It's that they're more open. Yeah, now I can see them. So next is then finally there we go. Okay, so that's open now. Let's go save and heal then. then come back. Alright, doesn't matter to me. Reset. Okay. Damn it. It's 
Seriously, it would have been nice if they let you just switch through the, you know, cycle through the weapons. It's lo Oh god, I don't have the key! Come on! Well, where's the key then? Alright, where's the key? Over to the teleporter in the northeast, you'll be taken to a narrow lane. Alright, so northeast, then fall off the bridge. H how do I fall? Okay, I'm not sure how I'm supposed to fall off the bridge. Okay, well that was annoying. Whatever. Alright, how many... Magic eyes, do I have to fight this or hidden eyes? Idealistic roaches check in, but they won't check out. Okay, so, oh, just one again, okay. Thank you. 
Man, I've really gotten that pattern down, huh? <coughs> the hidden eye has been obliterated! I still got one more left to do. You're kind of, uh... Kind of overstating how well I did there, I feel like. Alright. And last one. Let's see. What does this dungeon look like? I don't know why I was expecting a barrel to fall out of the sky. Oh. Oh. Okay. You know what? That. That's fine too. I can live with that. And, oh, okay, so, kind of lame, but whatever. Let's see. Oh, this place. Oh. We don't need to go here. Let's see. What's the matter, Alundra? Having a little trouble advancing? Tense those scrawny neck muscles. I'll be needing to use your head, lover boy. Oh, oh, now... Really? Okay. Huh. And the way is revealed to the faithful. Let's go! Oh, okay, cool. That's interesting. A bit of a reversal there. <coughs> okay, and... Okay, I don't have the key, so I can't open the door yet. So let's go back. Find those key, or find that key, I guess. All right, so. All right, cape time. Let's see, it's probably over here. Okay, not exactly, but, you know, it's still helpful, technically. Let's 
see. What's here? That's the start of it. So let's try over here. What's that gonna send me? Oh, that's different. Hmm. Come on, that's not fair. I made it. I should have it. God damn it. Damn it to hell. Why am I missing that? Okay. So... Come on, what the fuck is that? Oh my god, I am almost dead. Okay, uh, let's backpedal then. And heal. Alright. Oh, crap. So, that's not happening anymore. Good. Oh, that's not good. That's the opposite of good, in fact. Alright, uh... Wait, seriously? Oh. Damn it! Okay, I actually made it that time. Alright. Okay, yep, there we go. Okay, made it. Alright, let's go heal and save, and then we'll go wrap this up. But nice, pretty little bow. The best part is I technically got the three dungeons I wanted to do tonight done. So, you know, I mean, one of them was like an optional dungeon, sure, but, you know, I'll take it. Is that the right way? Yes. Okay, so... No! Damn it! Okay. Alright. Put that on, because... Let's face it. We'll probably need it. Oh, crap. Okay, yep. No, that's... Yep, that's perfect. That's fine. Since the other three nightmares have been wiped out, the last one must be the true Elaine. So, you've slain the other three souls in this body? So what? Nothing here has changed for me, nor shall anything ever really change here. I live for myself when they... yet lived, and I live for myself now that they... have perished. If you have finished saying what you will, leave this place. I want to be alone. Eternally. You can forget about me, but I shall remain tucked away in Elaine's subconscious forever. Wait, what? I was really expecting one more fight there, but I guess not. So, you have returned. Will Elaine recover, or has she been put out of our, or should I say, her misery? 
That's an extremely callous thing to, for you to say, Beaumont. She is, after all, one of your subjects. But no matter, Alundra has managed to save her and return safely. We should rejoice. Oh, Helene, my daughter, has opened her eyes! Am I dead? Are you angels? Thank you, Elantra. I knew when it came down to it, you would make the right choice. The heroic choice. Elantra, I've never been more impressed with your ability and he your heroism. And Maya, you too are to be commended. Fine work! Alundra, I swear to you, I'll keep my promise. I will never take another drink as long as I live. My daughter deserves a father who doesn't need a bottle to deal with life's hardships. Here, this isn't much, but I want you to have it. Exchange the iron flail for the steel flail Gustav offered. Ooh. Okay, so the flail got an upgrade finally. Nice. You two must be exhausted. Go home and rest. I'll stay here for a while and make sure Aline recovers fully. All right, then. Let's do it. <clears throat> I'm sorry to come here so late. It's it's Giles. He's gone insane again, Alundra. And it's even worse this time. I don't know what to do. I feel as if I'm about to lose my own mind. You must help. I don't wanna. Sorry to wake you, Alundra. I bring worrisome news. As if we should expect anything else in these dark times. Giles is again trapped in a nightmare. May is at his house, but refuses to enter his dream. I don't understand it. Once again, Alundra, his life is in your hands. I admire your fortitude, but do not know how you manage to bear up. I suppose you simply must. Well, then, you'd best make your way to Giles' house. Okay, uh... That was interesting. Okay, and uh, there we go. So, until next time, this has been <clears throat> Shrink's Awakening. I've been Professor Icepick, signing off. See you next time.